You may not know this, but millions of families have been fighting tooth decay for decades by simply turning on their taps. That's because 74% of people whose homes are connected to a public water system receive fluoridated water, which is proven to fight tooth decay and improve oral health. Community water fluoridation is nothing new. In fact, it's been around for more than 60 years. Nearly 200 million people drink and cook with fluoridated water every day. Fluoride occurs naturally in most drinking water, and at certain levels, fluoride can stop or even reverse the tooth decay process. Because water fluoridation is effective and inexpensive, it's no surprise the Centers for Disease Control named water fluoridation one of the 10 great public health interventions of the 20th century. And it's not just the CDC either. The American Academy of Pediatrics, the American Dental Association, the American Medical Association, the World Health Organization, the Institute of Medicine, and many more recognize the health benefits of community water fluoridation. In fact, more than 3,000 high-quality scientific studies and research papers also conclude fluoridation as a safe, effective public health practice. So what is fluoridation and how does it work? Chief Science Officer Dr. Jed Jacobson explains. Fluoride exists naturally in nearly all water supplies, but usually at levels too low to prevent tooth decay. Fluoridation is the practice of adjusting the fluoride concentration to a level that will reduce tooth decay and promote oral health. In a nutshell, fluoride helps remineralize the surface of your teeth and prevents cavities from continuing to form. While drinking fluoridated water is a no-brainer for good oral health, fluoridation is not a magic bullet by itself. It's important to brush, floss, eat healthy, and visit your dentist regularly. 